Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be making a video on songs and artists that you need to know about in 2019. Now, these artists aren't necessarily underrated. They can actually, I think a few of them are, a few of them are actually quite popular, but they're just people that I think deserve more exposure and you should listen to. If you are new to my channel, you can obviously subscribe down below and also give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it and comment an artist that you also think is underrated because we should all spread the music love. Okay, great, let's get started. The first artist is called Kali Uche. She is, I'd say, not very popular. She has about a million followers on Instagram, which is obviously a lot of people. But in terms of on the mainstream side of things, she's not very popular. The most popular song is After the Storm. Another song by Kali Uchis that I absolutely love is called Dead To Me, which is basically like, you're dead to me. Oh my gosh, you would have never seen that one coming. The next artist I'm going to talk about is a girl called, um, I don't really know how you pronounce her name, I'm going to say Claro. Not 100% sure. So that one's obviously a lot more upbeat than the Flaming Hot Cheetos and like quite a few of the other songs she does, but I personally like both sides. Like I like the chill songs, I like the more upbeat songs, but her voice is really good. She's really talented. Oh, and also if you are like confused about like what I say or like if I pronounce it wrong, I'll put all the names of the people in the description and the songs that I played just so that you know if you can't understand me. Great. If you can't understand me, then that's really awkward. The next artist is well known, you know, she's the girl from Fancy, she's Charlie XCX, but not many people listen to other songs of hers. She obviously released 1999, which has done really well compared to some of the other songs she's published recently, like it's gotten quite popular. That's with Choice of Anne. Um, I love that song so much, like 1999. I wasn't born then, but you know, I somehow still relate. I try and make myself relate. I just wanna go back, say hey baby one more time. Wanna go back, wanna go. Try to find some to show you like, oh, you got under pressure. Those days it was so much better. No money, no money, we're goofy back then. It's definitely not underrated, but you should definitely be listened to more in 2019. So, choice of Anne, listen to him please. And like I said, songs are all in the description in case you want to know. Me, 
next up is my queen, my legend, Lana Del Rey. She's not underrated, but people are like, I don't know. No, they're not like that, but they all say, when I go Lana Del Rey, they're like, oh my god, you're depressed. And I'm like, what? They're like, Lana's depressing music. I'm like, no, she's not, but okay, go off. Like, not even they can stop me now. My life is sweet like cinnamon. Like a dream I'm living. Next up is Lily Allen, who was like the girl of 2007, if you're from the UK. Like, you probably know her. Not sure about Americans, like, what the deal is with them and Lily Allen, but she's gone under the radar, kind of, as in people don't listen to her anymore. But her old songs, they are so good. Look inside, look inside your tiny mouth. The music cut off. I recommend this to Lily Allen, like her old songs, because her new ones, eh, not as short, but the ones from, like, I don't even know, let's see when this came out. But that came out in 2009. And her first album came out in 2006. Like I said, she dominated. She was like the queen of 2007 pop songs, honestly. <laughs> Also, Baby, which is with Clean Bandit, that is like a song. Like, she snapped. Standing here with an empty room, I saw you there in black and cold. Take me back to the young September, don't know. But I'm already someone else's. Love that. Honestly, she is so talented and deserves a lot more than what she gets. Like, some of her songs are really popular, like How To Be A Heartbreaker, Prima Donna, but there's also songs that aren't as popular, like Fruit. It didn't go, I think, as large as all the other songs did. So honestly, I think just listen to her songs that aren't the ones that are the most popular and see if you find any that you like, because I found some that I love, and you probably will too. Lizzo. I hope that's how you pronounce it. I don't know how you can pronounce it any different. Why me and Greg gonna gotta be Greg? I just took a DNA test, turns out I'm a hundred percent that bitch Even when I'm crying crazy, I got boy problems, that's the human in me Bling bling, that's the kind of that's the kind of human Why me and Greg gonna gotta be Greg? I love that song so much. The um, so I don't have an outro for this video, which is just great. I have been editing this pretty much all day. Um, hence why I look like this. It's not. It's not good. All day. I come to the end of the video, and I'm like, where is the outro? Like, where did she go? Um, and it turns out that my camera just wanted to cut off and not tell me which is great, we love that the most. So I don't have an outro for this video, except I did have one more song to play in the video, and that was Good As Hell by Lizzo. You know what? I'm gonna play it to you for like 10 seconds just so you know what the song was. Baby, how you feeling? Just walk your fingers out the door And do my hands off, check my nails So that is the song, I know it's not that brilliant, the whole setup that I'm doing But I just wanted to make sure that you heard it because it was on the list So I am still going to put it in the description of the video And yeah, I'm counting this as my outro so I guess I'm just going to have to do my outro If you enjoyed this video then please do give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you want to 
subscribe basically. Leave a comment of an artist that you think is underrated and definitely deserves more attention in 2019. Hope that you will have a really good day and a really good week and I hope that I see you all in my next video. Bye!